morning. We got a pretty busy day, but I'm gonna make sure that at least we started with a bit of yoga. <laughs> Here is a fun fact, the Winter Olympics were held in Innsbruck in 1964. Here is another fun fact, TripAdvisor is a liar. We went on, we went on TripAdvisor and it told us there is an Olympic museum. I got so excited, I dragged Silky here, even though she doesn't really like museums. But we went in and there is nothing, there is no winter games museum that's a bit of a disappointment so we're gonna go we're gonna go to town we're not buying that hat for you it's been raining all day but that doesn't really matter I still need to go out there for a run I'm just gonna change quickly and we'll go All right, let's go. It's always those first few steps that are hard. After that, you get used to the rain. It's actually quite fun, but it might get quite cold up that mountain. about 750 meters of elevation gain I still need 250 meters of gain to finish my workout but there is a gate and there is a sign my German is not that great but I think it says be careful of deers with massive shoes I'm not sure let's continue this let's finish this workout it's so cold up here though, I can't really feel my hands, that's why I haven't been really been filming. I've got only about 500 meters left. Sorry, 50 meters left. 50 meters. It is becoming really, really cold. It took me about two minutes. To turn on the camera it is freezing I literally can't feel my hands I don't know if you can see this but this is 1003 meters I feel like I'm not too far from the top I'm another two or three hundred meters off the top but it's really really cold I think I'm gonna go down also, there's no battery and the GoPro. A lot of people think you win races on race day, but you win races on days like that when nobody's watching. There's no medals, there's no certificates. This is where you win races, those hard workouts. Okay, so I see a lot, a lot of cows. I'm gonna keep the GoPro on in case they get attacked. Hopefully they know that I'm vegan and nothing will happen. I do have a rock just in case. I'm scared. I don't know what to say. All right, I don't want to throw any rocks at any cows. I just throw it. I just throw it next to the cow in case he attacks me. My hand is frozen, so I can't even stretch my hand far enough so you can see me. But they look like they're nice cows. Hey, cow. All right. Before we go into the next scene of this. I just want everybody to know that I'm not scared of cows. I was just acting in the movie here. I was just trying to make this entertaining. I'm actually super, super brave. 
this is not the way that I usually behave around harmless cows. There is a baby cow here which I'm a little bit scared of. What do I do? What do I do? Go slow or go fast? I'm such a big pussy, that's so nice. But I am scared. I'm just gonna keep going up the mountain here maybe. Cows, I'm not gonna. Whoa, they're closing the path. I'm such a little girl. I'm a rock, they're not gonna attack me, they look nice. It's just that I'm so scared, I don't know why. They look like nice cows, friendly cows. So I'm just gonna risk my life here. Oh no! Oh, I'm okay! I survived the count! My brain is still frozen, so excuse my childness behavior in this video. see those things in nature. I don't know what they can do. Alright, let's go home. I can't press this off. I also think I know what that gate said. <laughs> I think it said keep the gate closed. There's cows inside. And I was actually considering running back so I don't get eaten by a cow. Alright, done. That was so much fun. About that scene with the cows, I'm usually way tougher than this. <laughs>